What's up everyone, this is Jared Production X, and today I have a simple tutorial on how to bypass any password on any Mac computer. Now this tutorial is going to help you if you have a passcode and you happen to not know it, so you can't log into your computer, or if you happen just to forget it. It's a very simple procedure. This tutorial is going to work for Mac OS X 10.6 or above, so that's going to cover Lion, Mountain Lion, Mavericks, and even the new Yosemite. But if you happen to have a Mac with a different operating system, such as Snow Leopard or Leopard, I also have another separate video covering that. It's going to be a link down in the description box below. But everyone else that has the newer software, just follow these simple steps. The first step is to turn off your computer. Alright, then when you know it's completely turned off, you want to turn the computer back on and you want to hold down the Command and R button at the same time until you hear so you hear another little sound like that, then you're going to let go, so keep on holding it. And what this is doing right now is putting your computer into recovery mode. Sometimes you will not hear a sound, like for me I didn't hear it. You just got to hold it for about 10 seconds and then let go. If your computer is not turning on and it remains a blank screen, that's how you know you're in recovery mode. So once you get to this screen, this is the recovery mode right here. And we're actually not going to use any of these right here, but instead we're going to go to utilities up here. Then we're going to go to terminal. So you want to click on that. Once you do that, you want to type in reset password with no spaces in it. Just like that, and you want to click enter. Now this little thing is going to pop up right here, so we just close out of that. Up here, most of the time it's going to be labeled Macintosh HD, so you want to go ahead and click on that. That's one we want to use. Okay, now you just want to click on the account that you want to use your password for. So I'm going to use that one. You want to type in a new password. I'll just retype it in down below. If you did forget your password, you should probably put in a hint so you can remember for next time. Put in save. Now this is just telling you that with your account, you're going to lose the Keychain app. Now what the Keychain app does is it allows you to autosave in Safari. So it's going to save your passwords for your bank accounts, or your social media, or anything you saved it for, or even your credit cards. This is a good thing because Apple is keeping your information safe. What this is basically saying is since you forgot your password, we're going to allow you to create a new password so you can log into that account, but it's not going to remember your credit card information and all that because you don't know your keychain. So just click OK and then what we want to do is restart. Alright, now it's going to restart just like how it normally would. It might take a little bit longer than it normally does to restart because it's doing some behind the scenes stuff. Once your Mac has restarted, just type in the new password that you just entered on the previous page. And then you will be able to log into your information. Okay, then it's going to log in. And there you go. If this tutorial did help you out, please do give me a thumbs up. It really does help out the channel. I got tons of more videos coming your guys' way. So if you guys have any suggestions for video tutorials, please drop a comment down below. See you guys in the next one. And this is Jared Production X signing off. Peace.